Why are there toilet paper commercials? Who's not buying this stuff? Hi guys, two things. One, I'm filming in a different spot just to give you guys a different view. Thumbs up if you like it. Um, and the second thing is I have my dishwasher going. It's kind of distracting, but it's straight in the middle of the cycle, so I'm not gonna stop it because of the, you know, sanitization. But <sighs> Dollar Tree handmade cards, and I didn't even get all of them. Why? Why didn't I just get all of them? I absolutely love these cards. I do end up using them. It's just, obviously, I get so many that it'll take years to use some of them, but I adore these cards. I can't say enough good things about them. This is going to be the Christmas 2019 Dollar Tree Handmade Collection. If you're looking for different ways to use these instead of you know, giving it as a Christmas card. These are going to be wonderful in planners. Use them as your focal point. You can, you know, write inside of the card. Like there's just so many ways that I've used these in my planners. And you can also do friend mail. There's actually gonna be a really fun video that I have planned for like a DIY gift kit. But I don't wanna give too much away and these will be great for that. But let's just go ahead and I will show you guys each and every card. Let's start with the top. I am not picking in any specific order. I'm just picking straight from the top. So here is this one and I do like to keep the wrapping. So sorry about that glare, but that's how you know you're picking the handmade cards because Dollar Tree displays them in separately from like their, their card section. They have a lot of detail to them, whereas the regular Dollar Tree cards, they're just flat. They're flat, they don't have layers, not most of them have foil or all the, the rhinestone-y, all of those things. So that is what makes these so special. Like you can see there's a bow here and this one is a tree and it says Mary, like on a little flag there. So, so pretty, wishing you a Christmas full of love and cheer. And then the envelope is red and pay attention to the back. Okay, this one is hilarious. I love how the whole crew is stacked up like they're peeking from behind the door. This says, oh, what fun. And then you can see that the gift, and I don't know if you can actually see that, but the gift, the tree, and the candy cane are all like pop-ups. You see that? And the envelope is red on this one too, and the image is a wreath. Here's the next one. Just a good old classic Santa. I love it. I love the way that they framed him, making it look like a picture frame. I love this, like, ribbon. It's not actual, it, oh, it is. It is actual ribbon. It is a green, I don't know if you can see that there. You can just see all of the layers and the detail, and he's saying, shh, you know? Um, so, oh my goodness. You can see the night sky in the backdrop. Absolutely love it. You get a green envelope in this one. And then here is that image. Oh my gosh, what you don't know is I'm struggling to film this because for whatever reason today, my voice is like going in and out and I keep having to clear my throat. <clears throat> I gotta make, I gotta pause. I gotta make a cup of coffee. I'll be right back. The next card I feel like is going to be a lot of favorites. Look at all the different versions of winter hats. I love this. And also, this isn't just all Christmas cards. If you don't celebrate Christmas, Dollar Tree has other options available that just say happy holidays and things like that that aren't, you know, focused primarily on Christmas. And this is one of them. It just cozy holiday wishes. The same thing on the inside. I love the red envelope with this. They always choose the right, whoa. Someone wants to... <laughs> mm, my brother has problems. What was I saying? I just, I love the red card. And then you get the extra red hat there. And I will say that these three right here are pop-ups. So they stick out a little bit. And the, the fuzzy top of the hats are actual little pom-poms. 
Ooh, this one. Oh, I love this. You guys, it just makes me so happy. What is it about these handmade cards that just, mm, they just get me. I want to watch Home Alone. But okay, so this one is interesting. I'm not sure. I'm not sure I feel about the red envelope. I don't know, but I love a good nighttime snowy scene. And he is just as foiled as can be. They even added the gold touch on the trim too. Gives it that really gorgeous Christmas sweater look. And then you can just see all the detail that they put inside some of these cards as well. I mean, they're a dollar. That just shook. And then here is the back. It's all navy on the back, which I really like. Again, I'm not sure about the red. I, You know what? If they had done like a forest green bow and a forest green card. Oh, this one. I don't feel like I even need to say anything. Santa is going up, up, and away on this beautiful town that's nestled in the mountains. And then, I don't know if you can see, but there's like a, this is an extra layer on top of this back layer here. And look at all of the houses and the trees. Look at the roofs on these houses. They're just capped with snow. It is just simply gorgeous. I absolutely love this card. Wishing you a magical Christmas. And then, Ta-da! This card is everything. Is, is he still going crazy? He is. All right, the next one is so, so fun. Oh, is it 2019? I mean, you guys haven't even seen a fraction of these quite yet. Merry and Bright, they went with more of a silver. I love the string of lights, but I just love Christmas lights. And then you've got all the characters, the penguins upside down, snowflake here on a red envelope here's one that's has more of a classic feel and just take just take in all of the colors something about the ombre of this blue the snowy scene the wreath the bells that's in gold foil and the back is that and look at the envelope i don't know that i've seen them do a baby blue for christmas maybe they have but and then the inside you get these detailed corner scrolls or whatever what are those those called in the corner when they i don't know there's a name for them and then look at this down here with the snow on what is that oh it's like the branch here's the tree right here i just noticed that top branches some lower branches oh this one's beautiful this one is also just look at this you've got your classic christmas sweater and they even put a sweater to emphasize the print and look at that red, very shiny, metallic. The sweater itself says Mary on there. And then it's on a red envelope. And then look at the back. And here's another Christmas light. It's a lot different than this one, uh, but I love the variety. Pretty simple, Mary and bright. The red has a glitter. I don't know if you can kind of see that. So are the lights. Really love that one. Look at that. How cute. And then wishing you much happiness this holiday season. Ooh, this one is simply gorgeous. Look at the antlers in the poinsettias. I love the red foiling on the letters. You get a red envelope. And then in, in the center of each flower, you see there's an additional element of a yellow rhinestone. It's beautiful. Really, that yellow rhinestone makes it. Because had they have gone with red or green, it just I don't think it would have looked as luxe as it does. And then you can see the farmhouse elements in this too with the background. You see that like white washed wood back there. Love it. Here's the inside. And then there you go. This scene is just charming. It's a snowy scene out in the forest. You get a lighter sky here. I love that. I, I know, am I sounding silly? But I love the nighttime snowy scene. Then you get a daytime snowy scene. I just love all the variety that they're putting out. Look at this cute tree that gives it that Charlie Brown look because it's not that full. And the snowman is decorating it with a fox. And he is just decorating this tree in the forest with his little friend a fox 
who is wearing a scarf and looking just as charming as his snowman friend. Wow, I didn't expect that. I don't know that I've ever seen them do an image like that. And then they did it again on the back, but in color. It doesn't need any explanation. It's simply stunning and it's a dollar, dollar tree. Can we talk about this, the North Star here and how beautiful they made it? And then that gold foil, wow. Just absolutely wow. It's just gorgeous, oh holy night. And then the envelope again with this blue, but I wanna point out that it is a different shade. Look at that, can you see, can you tell the difference? It, well, no, they're exactly the same, Never mind. But, oh my goodness, just absolutely stunning. This, How cute is that? I love that they went horizontal with this rather than like a vertical card, so you would open it like this. Love that, love that they're giving us that variety. Um, when it comes to how you're opening up the card, you get that same red metallic that we saw in the other card. It says Merry Christmas on a huge pop-up. Santa's holding a gift and his hat is a huge white pom-pom. It's another nighttime scene. It's a long um, horizontal, am I? No, vertical card. Look at that. The snowman is so cute. He, I don't know what he's doing. I don't know if he's dancing, but his hat is kind of flying off and his scarf is up in the air. Here's the inside. Ooh, I love that. See, look at those snowflakes. May your holiday season be merry and bright. So pretty much every card has a unique um, message on the inside and I like that. And then obviously I'm using my favorite item tag so you'll know which one is mine, but Fala La La Llama. Oh, then he has a stack of presents on his saddle that has pom-pom details. Oh, look at his scarf. He's wearing a hat. His ears are sticking out of the hat. His body is dusted in white glitter. And the stack of presents is probably my favorite. And they added a bow to the top there and then the string down the center. Ooh, here is a good blue one. Look how gorgeous the snowflake is. Wow, you get all those beautiful pink, purple, and green colors. Look at this ribbon with a little charm. You get a snowflake charm in there. And the envelope is a silvery gray. Oh my goodness, love that. Because they could have easily have gone with white. Really, they could have. And instead, they gave us a gray. Love it. Oh, I didn't show you guys the back of this one. All right, we're coming down to the last two. Look at this one. Dun, da, da, da. It's a bunch of Christmas clothing on um, a clothesline, a clothing line, a clothesline. Yeah, but look at all the detail. What does that say? Warm and cozy wishes. Love that. Love, love, love. Look at that sweater. Uh, one of my favorites. Definitely one of my favorites. Oh my gosh. It's another snowy scene. I love it. I think I love it so much because we rarely get snow here in Dallas. And look at this extra ribbon of silver. And all the details. Oh my goodness. This is absolutely freaking stunning. And then look at the the way they decorated the corners. A dollar. A freaking dollar. <sighs> Somehow I still made a 20 minute video. Hopefully I can get this down in editing. But I hope that you guys love this. Comment, let me know which card is your favorite. And I hope you guys find this collection at your stores. And stay tuned. I can't wait for you guys to see what else I found at Dollar Tree for Christmas stuff. You're just not going to believe it. You're not.